Disturbing new details about a teenager who disappeared from a basketball game in Dallas. She was tracked to Oklahoma City after nude pictures of her showed up online. News Force Bria Berry is on Crime Watch with details. Newly filed court documents revealing the nature of a sex trafficking scheme. These are, are very bad players we're talking about. It was two weeks ago when a 15 year old girl was seen leaving a Dallas Mavericks basketball game with men. Family didn't know who they were. The girl did not check back in with her family. A week after her disappearance, Oklahoma City police received tips the teen was in the metro being trafficked for sex purposes. The 15 year old's nude photos posted on a website known for prostitution last Thursday. And police say these three suspects were all involved. A number of these people played a role in trying to get this girl trafficked. Uh, for purposes of sex, whether it was taking pictures as one of them did or simply placing ads as another one did. Court documents revealing the teen was in the company of one of the suspects, convicted sexual predator Kenneth Nelson. And last Thursday, Nelson was in a hotel with the teen victim the same day her naked photos were posted online. This girl is a juvenile and she was in the company of sex traffickers and that obviously raises red flags and alarms in, in our minds. Police were able to find out through those nude pictures Nelson did not act alone. According to court papers, Karen Gonzalez was the person taking pictures of the teen undressed and posting them online. Gonzalez was arrested at this hotel on the city's south side. There were a number of people involved with not only this girl but others but we did everything we could to find this girl. We dug deeper into Nelson's criminal background, and according to an Illinois sex offender website, he was convicted of sexually assaulting a three year old when he was a teen. Thankfully, we were able to get them off the streets before they had the chance to do this to somebody else. Bria Berry reporting police say the victim is doing as well as can be expected. As for Kenneth Nelson, we've learned he was convicted in Oklahoma City for failure to register as a sex offender last May.